comemos. Naimus Moses was a Cajun. He lived by himself in the swamp. He hunted alligator for a living. He just knock him in the head with a stomp. Louisiana law gonna get you, Amos. It ain't legal hunting alligator down in the swamp now. Well, everyone blamed this old man for making him mean as a snake. When Amos Moses was a boy, his daddy would use him for alligator bait. Tie rope around his neck and choke him in the swamp. Alligator bait in Louisiana Bayou. About 45 minutes southeast of Thibodeau, Louisiana. Live a man named Doc Millsap and his pretty wife Hannah. They raised up a son who could eat his weight in grossness. Name him after a man of the cloth. Call him Amos Moses. Now the folks around South Louisiana said Amos was a hell of a man. He could trap the biggest, meanest alligator and just use one hand. That's all they got left, cause the alligator bit it. <laughs> left arm gone, clean up to the elbow. Well, the sheriff got wind and Amos was in the swamp trapping alligator skin. So it's stuck in the swamp, gonna get the boy, but it never come out again. Well, I wonder where the Louisiana sheriff went to. Now you can sure get lost in the Louisiana Bayou. About 45 minutes southeast of Thibodeau, Louisiana. Lived a cat named Doc Millsap and his pretty wife, Hannah. Raised up a son who could eat his weight in groceries. Name him. Call him Amos Moses. Sit down, on him, Amos. Southeast of Thibodeau, Louisiana Lived a cat named Doc Millsap and his pretty wife, Anna They raised up a boy who could eat his weight in groceries Name him after a man of the cloth Call him Amos Moe